Yo, what's going on guys? Frosty. The Snowman. Here and today, we're taking a look at a weapon called the Redrix Broadsword. So this is a high impact pulse rifle. I'm going to go over the perks that I got. Arrowhead Break. I decided to go for this one because it makes the stability pretty uh, vertical and it gives you a nice little boost of handling speed. So range isn't the ultimate thing when it comes to this weapon. It already hits pretty hard at whatever distance. Anyways, I'm using high caliber rounds for the additional flinch. Outlaw and Desperado is the special perk for this pinnacle weapon. Basically, you'll get a kill, a reload, and then you can shoot this weapon so fast that you'll melt anybody in a fight. Now, there's a couple drawbacks or things that don't make this perk as good as it could be. And that really is the muscle flash, to be honest. And also the sights right here, it makes it really hard to see where you're shooting at uh, when you're aiming down sights at an opponent. So... If they would change those two things, give it like a hologram sight or something like that, dude, it would be sick. I'm using handling mass work on this thing. I would prefer either stability or range as well. Icarus Gip is pretty important since I'm going to be on a hunter. You know, I'm going to be a cricket jumping around. Now, another thing I'm using in this loadout is going to be six coyote. So I get double dodges and I'm combining that with bottom tree arc strider so that I have two opportunities to basically get damage resistance if I get in a situation that... Uh, I might lose in or if I'm in a gunfight and I need to, you know, trick the other opponent to miss his shots or whatever. Anyways, I'm going to be using my Mind Bendish Crutch, Vulture, Gakurai, Slide Shot, Quick Draw with Stability Mass Work and Icarus. And I'm using Warcliffe Coil as my power weapon. The remainder of my perks and mods are things to cater towards the Pulse Rifle. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoy. It's going to be a comp match, so let's get into it. Survive. These guys are packing two spare rations, two warlocks. Every death will cost you, Guardian. Handheld Supernova. What do we got? We got a Sunbreaker and a Goldie on our team. Okay. Kind of flexing with the Goldie, all right? Three lives left. Nice. Uh oh, down by two lives. No lives left for your enemy. Destroy them. Good comeback. Nice little three piece annihilation to win the round. Let's go. Yes, that was all of them. Round starts. You're ahead. Three lives left. Would have been a good opportunity for a shotgun pull. Enemy team is out of line. But the primary oh, shots right now too crisp. Left on either side. I'm on the edge of my seat. Back away. One minute. No more second chances. 
Fight to the finish. It's all up to you now. Destroy them. This is it. Oh, almost got away. Saw the radar ping. By the time I turned around, it was too late. Got the good timing on the pinch. Maybe I could have stayed up there too. On the little pillar. Tough to say. Got caught in the air. That's not good. One on the left, right side. Teammate kind of loses one. Okay. Almost got that Mr. Hesha. A little bit too far. Nice, it got cleaned up. That's all that matters. No more lives on your side. No life left for anyone. Rest when you're dead. No more second chances. Fight to the finish. We traded. So we're going to leave our teammates in a 1v1 situation. He has grenade launcher. Nice. He connects the kill, winning us another round. What an insane power ammo shot, man. We didn't expect anything less from a dredging. Gonna shock on me. Only one minute left. Uh oh, they got power. Fight on just a second. Damn. Your enemy won the round. You're evenly matched. Might have to rely on my shotgun a little bit more. I'm pretty invested in using this Regex. It's pretty fun. But fun doesn't translate into being good, right? They got supers, we're down by a life. decided to choose me as his target instead of my teammate Samuel you're baiting me bro you have them where you want them finish this Three lives 
Dang. Tough situation here. Nice, he ran out just in time. Oh, floating in the air. Good play. The question is, can I get to that power before they get it? One minute. You're neck and neck on reserve. No lives left for your enemy. Destroy them. No lives left on either side. I'm on the edge of my seat. Huge. No. Ate his teammate. Got the better of you. I don't have a super anymore. Match point and tie. Finish them Train. Good. Left for your enemy. Destroy two for one. One minute left. The enemy is out of second chances. One opponent remains. No lives left for anyone. Rest when you're dead. Last one. Handheld supernova as well. Important. Play this as patient as possible. In a 2v1, you don't want to throw the round by pushing by yourself. Ten he does have a sniper as well. Hmm. Tiebreaker active. You have one last shot at survival. I'm pushing with a shotty. Send it to you. Nice. Let's go. The handheld could easily open up the situation there to be a clutch round, but. Even if he hit me, those double shade steps, no matter when he threw those, I was going to be able to live due to the damage reduction. And that was a play. You know, I knew the strengths I had on the class, and I took them. He went for my teammate. Teammate, I don't know, used a hunter jump ability. You, you know what they do. You know what they do. They're crickets, right? And he survived. I, I went in, bro. I helped him out. You got to be fast. If he gets cleaned up, he has health, gets another one. GG, seventh column.